Hello and welcome to After Sound Review, and this is my review for TFC Essence. Um, for some of you that might have known this brand before, the TFZ is the fragrance Zither, which is quite unique. It's quite well known for its somehow best bassy IEMs. Okay, just like usual, I will review them from the build, fit, frequency, response, sound, and comparison, and this is the fragrance Zither Essence. And honestly, from the looks only, this is my favorite so far from the TFZ. Right from the build quality itself, it is really looking really good. It's using a really hard acrylic or hard resin. I have tried a lot of IM that is using this kind of material, but I have to be honest with you that this is one of the best I've ever seen, I've ever touched because it feels thick and it feels quite durable. And the unique thing about this one is also the faceplate is really unique. I don't know how you do you call this color, but it looks gold-ish to me, but it's somehow combined with, um, I hope you can see them through my camera. With a different shade of lighting, it gives you this kind of rainbowy shade, but somehow it's still gold-ish and somehow it is also see-through so i've never seen this faceplate before but i can tell you it looks awesome and then you can definitely see the dynamic driver here it's translucent and the nozzle part is using aluminium it is using two pin connectors and the cable itself looks quite good and quite flexible it is twisted on the upper part and also twisted on the lower part it is four core and this is the jack it's shiny gold and when it comes to the fitting for my small asian ears it is somehow one of the best fit i've ever get in the im at this price range i don't know how they do that but it definitely feels really flushed in my ears and of course this is quite subjective because every person's ears are different from each other but for me this fit thing is really good in my ears okay let's just talk about the frequency response as usual you can access my measurement in this link and for me this tfz essence is simply v-shaped i could simply say that they are very v-shaped look at the contrast between the base and also the upper mid range to treble and the special thing for me about the TFZ Essence is the base it's always it's steadily going up and up and up until the sub base so it's one of a kind base for me in my measurement here there's no there's nothing like this one it's quite unique but for me uh one of the best tonal balance that I could ever get in IEM is from the Tangium Oxygen somehow and it can be categorized as Harman-ish, Harman-ish neutral. You can see that it's a big difference how the Tangium Oxygen is looking even almost neutral if you compare them to the TFC Essence. But this is the IEM that I use usually for comparison. I consider this IEM to be really uh, in my neutral target, this is the X1 Energy X01. It's actually quite similar to the Atimotic. And this is how is it compared to the Final Audio A4000. For me, the Final Audio A4000 have very special treble. It has very controlled and good timber, but also a nice crunch and nice edge to its treble. Look how it's much more tidy compared to these hills and mountains of the TFC Essence. So yeah, for me, if you're searching for vocal, you're not gonna get this here. And if you're searching for a good treble, it's not here also. It's not really stable on this area. If you're searching for bass, a really, really deep sub bass, for me, this is it. The sub bass is crazy, guys. So I tried this TFC Essence through some of my source like the iFix DSD, QDX 5K, and also I Ibasso the X160 and also through my phone the Samsung Galaxy S10 Plus and for those source I have no problem at all which is saying that these IMs are quite easy to drive and yeah 
no matter what kind of source it's quite easy to drive and the tonality itself as you have seen through the frequency response it's definitely v-shaped but i have to i need to tell you that the bass is the main star here it's just like saying how much do you want the bass yes the bass is the star the bass is definitely the main point of this im and maybe that's the essence of the tfz i don't know the bass let's start from the bass talking about the bass is quite hard it's really hard punching and i mean really hard in the deep fit it's as if you're going to a club and then the dj give you a really hard punching bass and then you're standing next to a subwoofer that's how it feels it's really punchy it's really big in quantity and also really really deep at some points i could get a little bit of no nausea when i'm hearing them so yeah because i'm not a bass head actually i love bass but this is simply too much for my taste but if you are a bass head i have a friend who is a bass head he likes this i am really much because of the bass especially especially in edm songs but in the mid-range area for me this is definitely too thin it is quite forward but it's definitely overshadowed by its big bass it's quite forward but a little bit harsh and too thin to be called balanced so it's uh, not for you who love vocals who has a sweet texture to it or really good intimacy uh, for example like Olivia Ong, Diana Kral, Joyce Chu, those kind of audio file recordings it won't suit this TFZ essence because it gets thin and also sharp to my ears it's just not really good for those kind of songs and also for the treble again it is quite forward maybe I'm guessing this is also for accompanying its bass for EDM songs you know because EDM is not only about the bass is also about the synthesizer and also all those uh, effects in the music that makes the sound fun and uh, the treble is quite forward actually but it's quite harsh if you are uh, instru if you play instrumentals or if you're playing a violin solo songs you will definitely hear that kind of harshness and graininess to the treble even though it is a little bit forward so again with this kind of tonality it is like meat for such a special kind of genre which is EDM for me because other genre doesn't really seems to fit this TFC essence at least at least that's from my ears and when it comes to technicality again the separation and resolution level is not really good because of how bassy it sounds it kind of overshadowed the overall detail and separation in this IM. It, it doesn't really separating the instruments or the elements from the orchestral song from like example for Hans Zimmer or Two Steps From Hell. But when you're hearing a live music such as the, you know, the Eagle Hotel California MTV 1994, it definitely could give you this kind of bass and depth to the soundstage so it sounds quite 3D-ish. And when it comes to comparison, I have some IMs here that are also using a single dynamic driver, but they are all sounds different. This is the Moondrop KXSS, and this is the final audio A4000. As for me, the most balanced of the three is the Moondrop KXSS, and it is also shown in the frequency response somehow. It's the most versatile of the three. You can throw vocal songs at it, EDM at it, even rock at it, and it will still sound good, but not as well as these two. This two is more like the specialist, while this one is being the generalist. The TFZ Essence is for EDMs, is for bass heads, and the A4000 it's like made for orchestral or for some instrumental because of it sounds the brightest of the three. But it also sounds the cleanest. It, so it definitely sounds cleanest and also more detailed. But it's the thinnest of the tree and it's the brightest of the tree. But even though it is the brightest, I could say that still the A4000 has this kind of smoothness texture over it. 
that the TFZ Essence doesn't have. So I still like the smoothest in the treble area, even though they are both quite forward in treble. But the A4000 is one of the best that I've tried at this price point. It's really extended, it's really sparkling, and it's really clean and clear. So for me, if you are a generalist, you want only one for a lot of kind of genre, pick this Moondrop KXSS. If you are a bass head, you have a lot of EDM songs, and the bass is your main priority, go with this DFC Essence. And if you are trying to hear, if you love orchestral music, movie soundtracks, or maybe solo violin, or maybe solo piano, for me, this A4000 is for you. So I hope that's all for me. Uh, I hope you like, enjoy this review. And if you have any question, please write down in the comment below. And see you next time. Bye-bye.